And we're back. Hello. Part two. I'm finding it very difficult not to just Part tell two. you things. I know. Uh, let's go up the stairs. Uh, this is locked, isn't it? Talk. Out on the hunt. Uh, then apparently. I'm very sorry, but I am Yosefka. Oh. The patients here in my clinic must not be exposed to infection. I know that you hunt for us. Please. This is all I can do. That's like a normal now, blood vial, but go. gives you more health back. And good okay. hunting. Um. I assume well, all NPCs have something to do in the Souls game, but I'm not up to the point where I know what she is yet. Oh, okay. But again, you'll already know this, so it's it's not bad to say. You always go back and you talk to the NPCs at varying points of the game. Oh, so we're just back here. Yeah. Yeah, she's locked the door that you first of all. Apart from that. Mm, considerably easier. Um. Yeah. Nothing important. Ah, I think. Save uh, some time. There's nothing. Okay. So have a look then. There's an item. Nothing in the room. Nope. Blood vial. What's a blood vial shard? Increases the a number blood, of blood a, vials you can hold. A bloodstone shard. Yeah. What's a bloodstone shard? It's a tight knife. Oh, okay. Open door. That does not look like that does not look that difficult to open. Maybe the hinges are rusty. Maybe you're rusty. Rusty. You must accept blood. Okay. Cook some bullets. Closed by a device. A, a lock, possibly? Maybe. Uh, okay. See, that looks hard to open. Still not as hard as you're making it. It's a bit rusty. Have you seen him as a skinny rake? Even he, when he's burly? He is a skinny rake. Remember courage. No, just out of interest. Um. <laughs> Just out of interest, when you were playing it, the demo? Yeah. Uh, look up into the sky? Was it twilight or night? It's night. It was night in the Because that's, that's the first thing that got me, because I was like, when I when I saw all the things, it was pitch black. Yeah. It doesn't look like the same area because of it. Unless when people were playing the demo, it was difficult, and so they brightened it up a bit, but I don't think so. Let's have a look. Anything in anything of intrigue? Doesn't look like it. There's a gate, some more notes. Have I just come I've just okay, come just from there, yeah, right. So I've got gates already open. That one. Oh up. yeah, I've just come back right in on myself, haven't I? Never mm -hmm. mind. Right, let's go over this way. What are you buying? Oh, bollocks! Are you feeling comfortable about not having a shield? Yeah. But that's possibly because when we were playing uh, Darky Souls 2 just before, I am now a character with. A big fuck off shield. Uh, no, because I remember I put my shield away so I could two hand my drumstick. Oh, yeah. So I'm, I, I have no defences anymore. Blood vial. Oh, it's good to know that's already up to eight. This brings the ladder down to two. Yeah. Was this bit of the Yeah. Pretty, pretty much. I, I've seen that. I saw that in the alpha build. That fucking ladder. Yeah. Oh! Right, uh. Molotov. Actually, I might equip that. Firebomb! 
Yeah, it's yeah, it's definitely not a definitely not a fire bomb. Um, let's pop yep. we'll pop the Molotov on there. So I ended up dying really quickly the first time I played the demo because uh, I didn't know what button it was to use blood vials. That was my hip. Your hip sounds like a crow screaming. Yep. Yeah. The lamp now transports you back to the hunter's dream upon death. You will awaken at this lamp. This is a hub lamp. You will see this lamp a lot. Oh, okay. Good. Good thing that you're checking all the doors. What do you mean? Just keep checking on the doors every time you pass one. Is it from this side? Yeah, sure. Cool. Wait a minute, go back. Something I've never checked before. Turn around. Is that window? What window? That one. Oh, um, not one from around here, I'm Gilbert. Gilbert! So you must have had a fine time of it. Yeah, I Well, I don't think I could stand this, but I'm willing to help. Oh, he's ill. No, they're just doing the laughing at all souls characters. You should plan a swift exit. Whatever can be gained from this place to... Um, good. Darling. Pale blood, you say. Hmm, but if it's blood you're interested in, you should try to charge controls all knowledge on blood. Across the valley to the east of Yarnum lies the town of the healing, and deep within Cathedral Ward is the birthplace of the healing. See. Arnhemites don't share much with outsiders. Normally, they wouldn't let you near the hunted on tonight. Because I didn't. Uh, because I didn't know about this when I first came through here. I've never seen him before. Really? But now I know what to look out for. Basically, check all the doors and windows. Oh, okay. Pebbles! I don't think I've ever used one. Start, mate. I've got clean Right. <clears throat> Down there is dudes. Over here is. less dudes. Right, uh, let's carry I can on. I can hear the uh, the rapid button pressing of someone playing a Souls game for the first time and not used to the swings yet. Yeah. Learn your lesson from last time. Do not piss them off all at once. You will start to notice uh the defining characteristic of doors you can check. There you go. The lever there. Not very golden then. He loves only gold. What about zinc? Only gold. Uh, what about zircon? He loves only gold. Platinum? Only gold. What about rose gold? Ooh. Ooh. Nah. Only gold! Pure uh, gold! Yep. This is just back here. Yep. What's the deterrent for mm -hmm. death? For what? The deterrent for death. The deterrent for death? Yeah. In what way? What do you mean? Well, you don't turn hollow. Yeah. So what's the deterrent for death? Nothing just really. Loss of progress. Loss of progress and the possibility of losing your blood. Okay. So consider I'm right next to a, a lamp. Yeah. Yeah, you've barely made any progress. No, you fucking douche. Ooh. 
Ooh, that was a tricky one. Of course, there's a way to do more damage to him if you get the title now. Oh! You got a gun for a reason, son. I'm good. Not cool. Yeah, when you ran out there, do you remember there was a guy out there? Nope. Dead. <clears throat> yep, there you go. <clears throat> I know I died. I need to rub it in. Thanks, champ. Oh, sorry, I was just rubbing it in. Fuck you, yeah. <laughs> <sighs> right. <sighs> if that guy hadn't turned off, I'd have been doing all right then. Yeah, because when you ran back out there, he's the, one, he's the first guy you meet. But I didn't rest at a bonfire. Oh, he must have come back from the other way, though. As soon as it smashed some boxes, you probably realised. Oh well. Come on, game. There we go. That's when you go back down here. Swings and roundabouts, really, innit? You went that far in when you went the other way. Yeah. How do you feel about the loss of abilities to just backstab all the time? Oh. Oh, yeah, what you he would have noticed blood. is he would have had purple blown eyes. Oh, okay. Because that's one of the things that doesn't just drop your soul. Sometimes sometimes the person who killed you or one of the people near where you died will inherit your blood and you've got to kill that thing. Which does make it possible sometimes if you get killed by a boss to retrieve your blood outside of the boss area. Mm. Which is nice. I suppose that's a way of going. Well, but you've on the other hand, on the other hand, to be fair, if you've got this game's equivalent of a home and bone, you can activate those inside a boss arena, so you could run in, get your blood back, and then warp out. Yeah. As long as you don't get killed by the boss. Is it? Uh, you're on a mission to kill him now, are you? Yeah. Is it a pride thing, or do you want to see what he's got behind him? I want to see what he's got behind him, and it's a pride thing. Right. I was going to say, because if you, the, the thing that he's got, you won't be able to use for a while. It's fine. Dead. Yeah. Walked into it. <sighs> I need to get used to the dodging. It's very, very different from Souls. I think. I think this one... One of the reasons why this might be my new favourite is I picked this one up straight away. I think this one's more tailored to my playstyle than yours. Yeah, because I was never much of a dodger. I was always a blocker. Yeah. Oh, so so this, this one this one is fucking made for me. I think it's because Dark Souls... Which is probably why when you saw this fucking beast in that boss earlier, I, was, I looked like a pro. Yeah. I think it's because in Dark Souls 1, blocking is a much better strategy than trying to dodge a lot of the time. Dark Souls 2 is kind of a mixed bag. You can do either or. And Demon Souls was a very much a Dodgers one. So I think because you started playing Demon Souls first, you got a lot more used to dodging. That's just me playing style though as well. Because I was like, I, you know, Dark Souls 1, I parried them, I didn't block. Yeah. Dark Souls 2, I just roll around the fucking place and let you kill everything. <laughs> <laughs> so the first three episodes are going to be you fighting this thing. No, I think I might uh, just give up on it now. I'll have one more shot. If it makes it be any better, I didn't even fight him until quite a way on. But I, I, I left him in the demo, so... Tell you what, let's have this shortened. Uh. Faster, less damage. Also known as the mode I never used. 
Isn't that that one that they're doing Dark Souls to fucking launch it off yet? Yeah. Get a bit of space. He's the same as any other Souls boss, isn't he? He's, he's, he's a bit harder to put you off fighting him, but you can beat him even right at the start. Yep. There we go. Right. Oh, three blood fast. That's not so bad. Oh, he didn't give you it. No, he normally drops something else. Oh, well. oh yeah, someone said that that knocks three points off the game on the Metacritic reviews, because after you've killed something, the bodies have no weight. Oh, f it's like, oh, it's unrealistic because bodies that are like massively. I'm sorry, I'd, um, I'm sorry that we've brought uh, unrealism into a, into a fantasy world where you inject yourself with blood to heal cuts. <laughs> Aye. Right, um, so I'll take it up here is the only way to go. The only way is up, baby. So what? I'm. Yes, I, j I only wanted these two. Fool. Oh. Yeah, a fool of a two. I was going to call him a fool of a two, however, my range was shorter than I imagined. There you go. I like the fact they actually have voices and shout at you. Mm -hmm. Are we, uh. No, we've got, we got time. So that's two of them. Let's have a look. See, the demo's coming back to me now. This is where, if you had chosen to drop down, you would have come. All oh, right. Well, that's a. It's going to say that's a talky door. Well, sorry, but I don't want anything to do with you. Trot along, will ya? Trot along, will ya? Trot along. Get out of my ass. <laughs> what? Do any standards? Get out of my ass! <laughs> you sound like you say, get out of my ass? That's what they shout. When, when they want somebody out of the house, they go, get out of my ass! <laughs> That's just not even words anymore, mate. Have you seen his standards? Oh, 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 bitch, please! Oh, fuck, I've pissed off quite a few. No, no, no! I like the fact I seem to do the exact amount of Oh, it's Shieldy Boy! <laughs> Who attacks with a shield? Who um, throws a shoe? Honestly. Shield guy. Let's try something. Are you trying to combo attacks for your land? No. I was trying to uh, parry. I'll tell you what it took me a little bit of getting used to. Oh, there you go. <laughs> I'm not very good at it on this one, but I will get good at it. Yeah. Um, what it took me a little while to get used to is when you're not locked on, you roll, and when you are locked on, you jump. Yeah. I know. Because they've got little red lanterns. Yeah, you go, you learn them. See, I didn't. I never caught the other two. That was the first one I found. Uh, well, but. Uh, <laughs> You need to help me on my hunt. Surely you want these things dead. They're just uh, terrified that they'll come in there. Um. Um. If you die quick. Yeah, I was going to say, this is the point where you start getting bullets, isn't it? So I need to start using my gun a little bit more. No, he, he was just a... He, all he had was a gun. Nice. I've played Souls before, my friend. But, uh, ooh, Bloodstone Shard. Right. Well, I think now that I've found a little corner I can curl up and hide in, it's uh, next time. Nope, that was Bloodborne. You're done. I'm done. Oh, that's the whole game. Bye, guys.